Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Alex Kazora. Now that we know Juju Smith-Schuster will have season-ending shoulder surgery, it gives us an, albeit unfortunate, moment to discuss one of the most underrated and overlooked aspects of the game. Injuries. No, not in the sense of players getting hurt. We see that all the time. Superstars to fringe players, they're all one snap away from having their season spent rehabbing. It's the things we don't see that matters most. What happens in the hours, days, weeks, months after the injury. The mental toll of a player marching along a season like Juju was only to exit the game done for the year. This was his first serious injury, one that's causing him to miss weeks and months. His job, his passion, his livelihood, all done in an instant. That mental toll, coupled with the physical injury, is something I and most of us can't relate to. It's not just the injury, but the standing in a locker room after the fact. It can vary team to team, player to player, depending on the locker room's makeup. But when you're injured, it can feel like you're not part of the team anymore. You're the injured guy. Sure, you're in meetings, you're around the guys, but it's easy to be a ghost, to be forgotten. No longer are you part of the game plan, on the field celebrating, the face that everyone sees each week. That's a lonely, jarring, difficult feeling, I'm sure. Juju won't take a snap on the football field until August of 2022, and he doesn't even know what team he'll do it for. That story isn't unique to him, but it's a good time to highlight it. I'm sure his teammates will support him the best they can, but it's the ugly underbelly of the NFL in sports worth at least mentioning. For these guys, playing in the NFL while healthy is tough enough. Not getting to play in the NFL because you're hurt is even harder. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with myself and Dave Bryan every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.